Hello everybody, welcome to game number three in the uh, Crendor Viewer League. I'm 60 TV down, so I get Babe and um, playing against Commissar Tier or Tire with, with a dirty player skeleton after two games and a block thrower after two games. I mean, the block thrower is fair enough, isn't it? Because you could score a couple of touchdowns on him. But uh, pretty disappointed that he's got a dirty player already. 12 players, so there's going to be there's going to be a lot of fouls. Um, which is not good for my guard catcher and my one ward answer. What a bad game to be missing a ward answer when there's when you know there's going to be fouls flying in. Uh, so yeah, this could be this could be very uh, very bad. I did snipe him once, Skadir Nick, and he was a he was a very good sport about it. And I thought, you know, he was uh, he was quite chilled out and and quite all right. Whereas some of the people whine about dice and everything, don't they? Whereas he was... He was okay in my book. When you think of all the people who stream Blood Bowl, he's probably one of my favourites. Myself excluded, of course. <laughs> I'm the best. <laughs> but... <laughs> um, what would Inarion do? A kick and try and turn over, I guess. Let's be serious. Done then, I guess. One dancer sucks. Hello. You've never seen an iron kick first. <laughs> oh well. Well, if I'm playing like an Aryan, I'm going to kick first. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Which go? I guess so. Really jelly deals. I love kicking first because then you see. I mean, every time I got the chance to kick in the World Cup qualifiers that I won every game in, um, <laughs> I chose to kick. And when I played against, and then in the World Cup, I think the game that I lost, um, I think Ornan chose to kick against me. <laughs> Ah, oh, they always kick first. All right, okay, Jellyo. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I think it makes more sense if you plans to steal. Then you've got eleven players in defense, haven't you? Go for the steal. You can score in two turns if you've got seven players or six players. Sometimes I think seven players is when it's still. Reasonable to expect to score in two turns. It gets a bit harder, less than that, doesn't it? Pal. Exactly, Adon. Yeah, you know where you stand then, don't you? You know if you've got to score, score, score early or whether you've got to stall and stuff. But I guess, I think to me, that's the biggest advantage, knowing whether you've got to score early or whether you've got to stall. Whereas the fact that Inarian never feels he needs to stall. Means that he might as well receive and get a few mighty blow hits with his tree, I guess. Yeah, a lot more flexible. I think that's the way. I think that's the, the like the safest way to play them, isn't it? Is to be uh, is to be flexible. No, oh, the guy behind the tree doing its job there, generating a punch. Oh, Grindel, no, getting mugged probably, going to get f fouled, fouled a lot probably, he's got a dirty player, though he's on the bench, the dirty player's on the bench, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> made, a, made a cock up there, it is he saying, oh that's right, I had a DP skelly, I forgot, <laughs> glorious, 
<laughs> so he doesn't have his dirty player for a drive. That's help. That's helpful. Um. So yeah, disre disregard that statement. <laughs> Oh man, he's gonna foul anyway. No, no, he's not gonna foul anyway. Surely not. Yeah, he still can foul the team to death, but still, it's less likely, isn't it? Oh, I thought he was gonna pick up with the Tomb Guardian there. I guess he can spread them around a bit, can't he? Because I am weak. Maybe that was in case he got a touchback or something, eh? I don't know. Yeah, ducky fouls. Some ducky fouls are gonna do me. I'm just gonna just gonna punch things. If only, if only, to, if only trees were like movement four and didn't have take root, I could have totally blitzed that tomb guardian and split his team. Would have been an interesting play, wouldn't it? Yeah, because he do, he does it. He does it in important games as well. He does it not against noobs. No, if only trees were still trees, but just strength six, good players. <laughs> Imagine if they were just strength six, movement four, no take root. They were just the best players. By them. They were just double strength up black orcs. <laughs> the best. <laughs> Fuck me, that'd be a pretty good rookie player, wouldn't it? Uh, yeah, one's missed next game, Grindle. One more answer is missed next game, which is uh, disappointing, of course. Yeah, that's that is the craziest thing. Yeah, so Don Nicholas and Jelly. Yeah, that is the crazy thing that Inarin just does it against good players as well. It'd be fine if he, you know, if he if he does CCL his opponent, he's sub fifty percent. Right, I'll turn him over and you know I'll score in two and turn him over and win five nil. That that's fair enough, but would be fair enough. But he just does it. Yeah, he does it in the playoffs against. He does it against Shawnee every time and loses two one every time. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is strange, isn't it? I don't know how he's protecting the ball here. Yeah, like that, I guess. It's still risky, though. I still don't know how he's protecting the ball. How is it, how are you protecting the ball? Oh, well, the one die splits. Oh, he didn't even re-roll it. Oh my god! Oh, it's it's a loner block, but still, power him. 
and then run around the outside. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. GFI maybe, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Double GFI. Yeah, I don't like that double GFI to hit. I don't like a one dice on the ball either. One, two. Oh, and he's in the way as well. It's actually not easy to hit the ball, is it, with with an assist? I mean, I could just dodge in seventy five percent. Or I could just one dice block. I could two D as Tomb Guardian down. One day this Tomb Guardian, power him to there. And then then it's two D. Got a scoring threat. Got to get him out of the way. I can't bring guard in though. I can't do anything. Oh well, it wasn't a pal. Punch the Tomb Guardian. Get up there. He's block, isn't he? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He could do two pluses. And I could leap in to 2D. Don't really want to leap in though. It's a fucking skeleton. I could one dice block. That doesn't seem very good, does it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Could put guard in there and blitz him. But then the guard gets punched. Which isn't great. But what would Inarian do? He'd fucking go for it. I wish the trade stood up, that would have been pretty nice, wouldn't it? I don't want to sacrifice, I'd love to put him there, because he's got leader, I can't, can I? That's the shit thing about leader. Maybe he gets served, uh, so no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't really love to put him there. What's he going to do? He's going to knock him down. I'll just put him in the middle. I'd have to GFI to pace him. <laughs> yeah, I think a power might have followed if I'd powered. Yeah. I think I would have folded if I piled. Oh, survived. Yeah, two minutes the next two seasons, yeah. Yeah, I'll have to I'll have to not think so much well, not articulate my thought. I mean I do the all the thing all my thinking's done instantly and the rest is just 
fucking pissing about <laughs> trying to articulate it, you know. You're the same, no doubt, Jelly. You know what you're doing in the first... You've, you've thought through your turn. You know what you're doing in the first second. And then the rest is just bullshit while I'm waiting for it to end, basically. <laughs> Toons did win, yeah. Oh, yeah, I should have done Chuckles. I've, I haven't done any Chuckles. Out. Wow, he doesn't get the follow-up hit on the on the to Tomb Guardian. Tomb Guard! Do you remember Spoon Guard? If you never... If you never, uh... oh shit, he gets powered. And if I'd fucking stood up the tree, he wouldn't have been able to do that. But of course, he gets the 2D, gets the power, gets the armor break, gets the removal. Classic. Classic war dancers getting punched. Fuck off, man. Honestly. Fucking honestly. Maybe I shouldn't have stayed. Maybe I shouldn't have got blitzed. But fucking hell, honestly, Dancer gets blitzed. Though all the Wood Elves get punched, fuck all. All the Woody linemen get hit, nothing happens to them. Dancer gets punched, instant removal. He doesn't clear the ball carrier, but... I guess, you know, doesn't care too much. <laughs> <sighs> uh, I don't know humorous chimp to be honest. Probably or uh, Orientalis, not Orientalis. Probably Artemis Black overreacted. I don't think it's a fucking. Don't think it matters at all how long the fucking turns are. To tell you the truth, I don't think it matters at all. Right. Well, how do I get the guard in here? I can chain him there with the guard, but then I need the guard to get the two D on him as well. He can block him out to there, but then, and then blitz with somebody who dodges. No, because then he's taking up a space. I don't know how I get the 2D on the ball here. I can't one dice him. I just can't. I'm allergic to one dicing. Alright, I'm gonna roll two two pluses. <laughs> lads, boys, lads, let's get the oh shit, if it's him then it's Alright, there's a catcher. I should have stood him up first in case there was a failure of things, shouldn't I? Very bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, double GFI. Or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one GFI but loner. Or one, two, three, uh, one, two, three, four, no, I can't do that. I guess he's just got to stand up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, few, three two pluses. Probably going to have to use the reroll. But, he gets three dice as well, the guard. But I've got the I've got the thrower and the other guy to recover afterwards. Ah, well, that's fair enough. Only fifty fifty made two three two pluses, wasn't he? Ah, it's a double one, of course it is. Snakes, chuckles, 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 chuckles. He gets smashed and powered, of course he does. We'll see if any if there's any Crendor fans watching, which there could be, I guess. I'm not normally this fucking miserable. But 
I am miserable, so that's why it's it's coming out in the game. Can't help it. At least I'm playing the game. Which is more than I did yesterday. <laughs> that could that could lose me that, couldn't it? Losing the reroll, losing the dancer. <laughs> no, it's true. It's true. I really am. I'm all right when I'm when I'm when I'm healthy. I'm all right, but um, I'm really, really not. And maybe it's not going to change. So maybe I should stop streaming. I don't know. He's a he's a streamer, Ricky Legend, who uh, occasionally streams Blood Bowl. Um, and when he does, he gets like 2,000 viewers or whatever. Um, I mean, like, he always, we must always get 4,000 off, whatever. But uh, yeah, there you go. There you go, Grindel. Grindel's explained it much better than me. Well, I didn't really explain it. I just said he got lots of viewers, which is true. Well, lost the guard, lost the dancer, lost everything. Double wand. Yeah, it's very good for Blood Bowl visibility. If I was, if I was focus, I would have taken the, uh, how much, how many champions ladder scenes have we had? About 20. So how much is that? Five, wait a minute. They spend no. There hasn't been twenty seasons on uh, on the old formats, has there? But it's about a grand a season, isn't it? So if we say about forty grand, they've spent on Champs Ladder. <laughs> I'd have taken that forty grand and given it to um to like you know fucking Trump, not not the Donald, but the Hearthstone one, or uh, a Maz <laughs> or Creparian or somebody like that. And got them to play it and have fucking thirty thousand people watching. That might have been a, that might have been better advertisement than putting money into a competition that makes people not want to play Blood Bowl. <laughs> but there you go. That's just me. Well, this is fucked now, isn't it? Absolutely fucked. On the wrong side. I mean, that was that was a big commitment. Maybe I shouldn't have done it. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done that. It was a big commitment. And I used a fucking new one. And I got knocked out. Hello, Yuri Stars. Do you know what happened, Yuri Stars? I haven't done them for a month. I missed one day, like, I don't know, Christmas Eve or something. I missed, didn't do the, didn't do them, so I, uh, so I, uh, I stopped. Oh. Oh, shit, scrambling. Ah, too late! <laughs> too late! <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> too late. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, too late. That's why you should always have it a manual, I guess. Shit. Too late. Now I've only killed. <laughs> Three plus KOs though, so that's all right, isn't it? At least he hasn't got a dirty player for the two fouls he's going to make. No, three fouls he's going to make. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have gone in that turn. Eh? Maybe I shouldn't have gone in that turn. It was a very costly turn. I could have just blocked and. Uh, 
kept my dancer safe and then gone in harder the next turn. But as it is, I got the dancer. I mean, I was unlucky to get the dancer KO'd, I guess. If I didn't have the dancer KO'd, it looks a lot better. And then going around the back of the, that chain out and going around the back, um, obviously I did roll the double one. I could have popped the ball loose. But going around the back like that took two players out of the play, didn't it? Even if one hadn't been, even if I hadn't failed the double, you know, hadn't rolled the double one. So it was a bit risky. <laughs> yeah, no, crazy, isn't it? <laughs> hey. Oh. Hey. Right, smash this fucking Tomb Guardian for the second half. That seems like the best thing I can do. Take Groot and get a push. Yeah, super. So I'll just get my leader punched. That seems like a completely gym thing to do, doesn't it? Brilliant. Nothing says nothing says Jim more than fucking doing that, eh? Fuck me. What a load of shit. What an absolute load of shit. Oh, Kazan, it's stuck. Glorious. Well, that's pretty good. Now he's down to 11 max, isn't he? Oh, shit, then I'm going to get the thrower, Kaz. <laughs> you mean you wouldn't re-roll the skull that he rolled? Or you, you're rolling the GFI, yeah. Oh, man, three dice, sir. Ouchie. Probably, maybe I shouldn't have gone for it. Maybe I just shouldn't have gone for the uh, sack. Maybe I shouldn't have gone for the... Uh, maybe I shouldn't have gone for the blitz that exposed the guard. I mean, the guard could have been cast, and the dancer could have been cast. Maybe I should have just played it safe for that turn. But, I mean, I was... I was going for the, uh, you know, full Inari, and Inari would have gone for the riskier play, wouldn't he? But, yeah, Get it was a big commitment. little cunt! Ha, 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 ha! Fuck off! <laughs> It was a big commitment, don't know whether I should have gone for it or not. <laughs> Undoubtedly out mean, yeah, that go that goes without saying. That goes without saying. But I'm in the league, I agreed to play, so that's it, I gotta play, I don't know. Yeah, if it works, that's the thing, isn't it? It's what it's what Inarin would do. So, yeah, of course he's going to foul, even though he's only got 11 players. It's fair enough, isn't it? It's taken away a reroll as well. Fails. Banged on. Absolutely banged on. All right, this is a good move here, look. Um... Get ready for the, the best move you've ever seen in your life. Slight exaggeration. But it's quite a good move. Nevertheless. No GFIs required doing it around this way. Get the push. Say hello to Mr. Tree, dickhead. It's smashed. And no armor break. But that's okay, isn't it? No. I like that play. <laughs> but yeah, men, men up now. He's down to 10. But, well, not men up. Potential men up, yeah. Down to 10. 10 max for him. Oh god. No, I don't like 
I don't like the three dice and with block here. This is could be dangerous for the catcher. No, it's only two dice in them. Good. Yeah, especially Skaven, yeah, for sure. And it doesn't matter whether you're using them or whether you're against them. It's they still make the game dicier, don't they, than if it was just bash. But then I guess bash make it more about the skills, I guess, than the players. If you're down a bunch of TV to another bash team, you're going to struggle, regardless of coaching ability. Aren't you? If they've got the better team, it's harder. Yeah, Woody's, Woody's, I mean, well, to be fair. Oh, wow, he's going for a farm and, oh, wow, wow, in one reroll, he goes for the farm. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Fucking hell, Dr. Disrespect over here. Holy shit. Wow. <laughs> Oh, I'll get the fuck off my pitch. <laughs> Alright. Well, I've got to just go here then, haven't I? What do I do? Scoring threat. <laughs> Yeah, I guess I should have done all that. I should have played it properly instead of just doing that straight away. I should have thought before more before. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. GFI. Maybe I just maybe just stand in front of it and just try to stand. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Scoring threat. Going to hand it off to him. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I just think stand in the way. Maybe I should have gone for the pickup. It was only a five plus. It was only a five plus, wasn't it? Maybe I should have just gone for the pickup. At least now he's got the blitz as well, so it's a roll that could fail. I guess I should have just made the GFI there. I should have made the GFI there rather than all those dice because he's not doing anything here, is he? I should have made the I should have made the GFI with him, and then a GFI with him. And then the two GFIs with him at the end. That's what I should have done. So I played that shit. Should have actually spent some time thinking about what I was going to do rather than, oh, I'll put some guys there. That was shit. Absolute shit. Couldn't get the loners though. The loner there would be loads of uh, loads of dice first because I was blocking the path. So um, so I had to move the catcher first. That was the problem. Or make dice rolls and risk there being nothing in the way. But I mean, this is basically nothing in the way, is there? It's a three dice to clear. So yeah, I, I absolutely had to get. Um, I had to put one there. That was shit. I should have GFI'd with a catcher. I should have had catcher there, Lionel there, and it would have, 
It would have only been two more two pluses. Oh wow, this is uh, no, it's all right. It pushes fine. It pushes straight back. Oh, there you go. Because guard can guard guy gets knocked over once, killed. <sighs> At least the apple worked. Fuck me. Blog, Bloggy wouldn't have been knocked over either. No. No, it was shit play by me anyway, so it's alright. Deserve to, deserve to concede. Three or, three or four back, not the dancer though, but still, that's, uh, it's alright, isn't it? Ten players. <laughs> A chance of 11 for the second half. Would like to have a war dancer. <laughs> so I can block with block. Pretty useful when you've got no rerolls. Oh, one. Yeah, I just I didn't want to have nothing there. But having a catcher there is like having nothing there. And that other guy was nothing there, so it was just bad. It was, it was just bad. I should have should have made the riskier play of the first GFI first. I just wanted to not make any rolls and get somebody in the way. That was all I wanted to do. But... Mm. Shit. And I would have left the chain on if I'd just GFI'd with a light with the second guy. So I didn't want to GFI with him because then I thought, well, then he can chain me. So what I had to do was I had to GFI with the catcher first or go for the pickup. But I think the pickup probably wasn't wasn't very good. Right. Well, seeing as the catch is probably going to fail the dodges and die, I probably want to go for the touchdown with the uh, block one. Oh, the leader can get the ball and pass it. That's good, isn't it? The throw. I've actually got a throw for this. All right, so that's a 2D. Push, push, push. Then a block. Push. Then, actually... Can't get in this, can't fill in that square. Oh, yeah, I could, I could just run a guy around. Should have gone around. Move a guy in there and then get him three to there. Get him the ball. Run away, score. Bob's your uncle. Fanny's your aunt. Could blitz with block, couldn't I? Oh, no, he's, I'm going to score with block. Three, four, five. Six, seven, so okay. Yeah. Fuck it, if it works, it works. <laughs> yeah, exactly. He could have, he could have changed me away because I didn't make the GFI first. But if I'd made the GFI with a catcher first, he couldn't have changed me. So that's that's what I should have done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I should have done the pass already, I think. Ah, it doesn't matter. I don't want to do it now, though. Oh, I've, uh, I've done gift. I guess not. Should in the pass already though. I guess it doesn't matter. It's gonna be a three plus pass instead of a three plus catch. I 
Right, glorious. Did that extra one do me any good? I don't think it did, did it? <laughs> Probably did, though, with a reroll, right? Oh, I've got two minutes. Right, I'm going to samber it. I'm going to samber it. So, <laughs> we, we've got um, dodge. So, we can do a 3-3-2. Three, three, and then two GFIs, which is 47.1. Or we can do three GFIs and three two with dodge, which is 48.25. So yeah, that extra square, that extra square didn't do me any good. <laughs> hey! All right. <laughs> Lucky me. <laughs> Sometimes lucky. He even got the dancer back. Well, I know how Inari would play this and I know how I would play this. <laughs> <laughs> I really want to stall this out. <laughs> but, um... I guess Inarin would, would tr score in two turns. I really, I really don't want to fucking score in two turns. <laughs> oh, glorious Jumpy Jim. Thank you for the host. Glorious. Um... I should do the Inarian thing, I know I should. But I really, really, really don't want to now. Um, <laughs> Cause it's, it's wrong, isn't it? It's wrong. Thank you very much, Jumpy Jim. What would Inarian do, yeah. I'm, I guess seeing as the title is full Inarian, I should go full Inarian, but... It's just wrong, isn't it? It's just not a good move. Which is why I don't want to go full Inarian. Hello, Von Grunk. Hi, right, is there anyone on five? I needed the touchdown way more on the catcher, but I just thought I'd fail it, so that's why, <laughs> that's why I didn't do it. It would have been better, because then I was blocking with the catcher, and I could have been blocking with a blocker and getting the points on the catcher. I guess the catcher could do a completion and a, uh, and a touchdown. No, no, no. Yeah, I could, I could score. Let's, let's fucking score early. Let's go full in Aaron. It's still got a full team. He hasn't. I won't score it in two. Because, uh, you know. I can't. I can't score in two. I just can't. Two rerolls. Holy shit. Let's push him. Right, it's better to make the block with block, isn't it? Let's make the block with block. Push him. That gives us the option for where to push him. Take root on turn one, of course. No problem if you if you're gonna score quickly anyway. Oh God! Removed him. Glorious removal. I want to blitz the dirty player. Let's get a cheeky canoring threat up there. So, I want to try and I want to try and make a bit of a move, don't I? I do want to try and score as early as I can, but I, I don't want to do it. <laughs> I don't want to do it full in Aryan style. Let's 
go and get a blitz here. <laughs> I do remember that. Yeah, Dante it was brilliant, wasn't it? You don't want to blitz a skunk in the tree. Uh, yeah, that would have been a good idea, wouldn't it, Hippie? That is what I should have done. But um, <laughs> I wanted to move the players out here to get to get forward into being able to score and on turn eleven. Um, another reason why scoring early is bad, because if I'd been thinking about scoring in eight, I would have definitely blitzed him into the root of the tree. It looks like he's going to stop us scoring early anyway, so that's that's good. That's one less thing to have to do wrong. <laughs> oh, I've let him blitz a cat dancer. That was stupid, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, that, I remember that. I remember that, Jelly Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Yeah, that was to stop it was to stop the disturbing presence, wasn't it? Yeah, it was the way to, the only way to remove the disturbing presence was to foul him. And then the bug prevented the bribe. <laughs> Helps helps with being good at chess, doesn't it? That's my uh, that's my problem with chess would be the complete lack of memory. Me oh, if only he wasn't rooted, could just blitz and smash through the center easily. But now, without that, I want to put Garden and blitz down the side, but that seems really shit. <laughs> Let's just do this first. This is the most important thing. Get up there. <laughs> Classic Jim. Got me the two dice, didn't it? Pretty good. Oh, I don't wanna see you later, prick. <laughs> Incredible play, wasn't it? I mean, to be fair, the situation was that desperate. I didn't Get see a, a good play I could make, so I thought <laughs> go God. for the go for the one that you know a low percentage play with a high payoff, isn't it? Not that it was that high because I didn't get the move forward, but still, it was high. Uh, it was high off in terms of you know being good. <laughs> It didn't really achieve much, though. I mean, it didn't achieve much, did it? Because, so... So there you go. It is, it is the Crendo Viewer League, uh, Wayne Farah. It's in... I don't know if it's got a website or anything. Probably not. Um, but I was invited into it, so took part. So there you go. Deserve to lose for it? No, I don't, Jelly Pally. I don't deserve to lose for it. I just went for a low percentage play that worked out, that's all.
Yeah, that's the thing. It was. It was no. There was. It was no. It was a low cost action, wasn't it? Really low cost. Uh, low cost. Um, maneuver. Right, I need the ball and the dancer. I want the dancer to score. I don't know why I handed off the catcher. The dancer wants the score, doesn't he? There we go. Right. <laughs> um, he can't be blitzed because of the the dead body, so that's good. Now we can, unless I roll a two plus. Uh oh. This is looking very uninarian like, isn't it? Um Yeah, and I knew he, I knew there was a lad behind me. Yeah, that realised, but he couldn't fill in this square, so he's still the, the, there's still no surf on actually. I, but yeah, it was it was all right to put. They didn't need to put a guy behind. He's, it's a one dicer against a bodger, isn't it? So it wasn't like the end of the world to leave him. It is only Narin like score. I've got to try and score, haven't I? I've got to push through if I can. What's this? He's a blitzra. I think dodged both of these. I really fucking want a score, but it's taken me two fucking turns to get it on the war dancer. <laughs> oh no, Infera. That's still glorious, though, isn't it? VGP deserves it, so that's good. <laughs> exactly, yeah, Tony. Yeah, that's brilliant. If anyone benefits from that, he's the best one. So, good for VGP. Yeah, if anyone deserves an accidental sub, it's VGP. Good for him. <laughs> oh no, he's going for the leader. The good thing is, if you use the leader reroll early, he's not a target anymore, is he? But, um. Oh, he's based the ball! Hope the base 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 sub the base base base. Hope I don't roll double ones, eh? Rock hard today, and so was my cock. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> Underdone, yeah. Very good. Anyway, I don't want to mention him. What are you doing? What are you doing here? What are you doing? Uh... <laughs> Right, so I've just got to not roll a double one. Right, that's the that's it. That is it. Don't roll a double one. Or a one in nine. Glorious. Non accidental resub. <laughs> Glorious, thank you very much, Goblin Six. <laughs> for the non accidental resub. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thanks for staying fantastic. Oh, yeah. It is a heavy potato, isn't it? But I've got to be like an Aryan. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Face him. Oh. One, two, three. He doesn't really do a lot there, does he? Three, two out for him. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That, the three, two out for him is really good. This is this is a problem. This guy, isn't it? This guy's a bit of a problem. This guy's a bigger problem. Oh, I was th thinking I could cut through the others, but I haven't done it now anyway. All that into just a fucking brazen potato. Glorious, thank you. <laughs> no accidental resubs of the bit. <laughs> Good old VGP. Oh, fucking hell, this chair's fucked. You can hear it, can't you? Fucking hell. Shite chair. I can chain people and stuff. You can probably do something good here, but... I was okay with potato wing. Would have been better to score on turn 12, maybe. Can't three dice though, can you? You can only two dice. Oh, he gets the Kaz. Poor Lona. Ripperoni. He has that uh, quite recently, Wayne Farrer. Believe it or not. Yeah, yeah, quite recently. Sage and Canor recently have hosted me, but I've I've hosted them as well. And I, I never didn't host them, to be honest. Yeah, real fake. I've got ambitions, but um, the last time I tried it was horrific, so... It's just hard. It's just fucking hard. I don't know what I can do at the moment. So one of this, isn't it, because of guard? Oh, it's two. Oh, he's got two assists. So it's a GFI to hit on two dice. Kills a guy. Is it a loner? Is it fuck? Brilliant. All these loners and you kill a real player. That's nice. Now maybe I should have GFI'd just so I'd be... Just so, one, I'd be further away, but two... Okay, if he didn't power me, I wouldn't have been trapped inside him, but of course he powers anyway. And breaks AV, of course. And Kazas, of course. Yeah. And kills, of course. Yeah, good. Good. I guess that's what I deserve for potatoing. I guess that's what I deserved. No, oh, thanks, real faker. I really miss being able to do it, but I'm fucking ill. I just can't fucking do it. I just literally can't. Why not? <laughs> hey. <laughs> Why not? Fucking dead dancer. Dead lineman, dead dancer in the same turn. Fuck's sake.
Yeah, but a dead dancer isn't good, is it? Don't have such a good recovery now. It's not over yet. Not quite. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Pass it with a screen. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go for the Inarian player, the proper Inarian player. This is. Which oh. well. used a rear on the dodge. If I'd not gone for the Inarian player, if I'd gone for the Jimmy Fantastic player, I would have done the recovery with the catcher because he's got dodge, obviously, because I'm not stupid. But I went for the Inarian thing that he'd do, which was be getting a completion, wouldn't he? There was payoff for going that way, but I would have done the safer play. But I'm not playing safe, I'm playing stupid. Oh, sorry, Inarian like. Um, I don't think it's the best way to play. <laughs> I think it's stupid. My team's getting wrecked because of it. Um, but there you go. Good. Good. I should have just done the safe play, shouldn't I? I shouldn't have gone for the fucking quick score. I should have gone for a turn eight grind. Ah, <sighs> oh, fuck this. I'm just fucked off, man. I'm just fucking ill as fuck. This is the problem. Wow. Just in constant pain, and it's just... It's hard to play Blood Bowl while you're being fucking tortured. Blood Bowl's torture enough, isn't it? Blood Bowl's mental torture, and I'm being physically tortured at the same time, so it's, uh... It's pretty hard. But yeah, I should have gone the safe play of the catcher, obviously. Made sure I had the re-roll re for the recovery. So, I deserve to lose. Fair enough, isn't it? I'm never going to play like Inarian ever again. Never going to make a zero re-roll team ever again. I might do, Tony. I might do. I don't see the point in staying alive at the moment. So, maybe I could just, yeah, be a heroin addict. Maybe that would be fun. I don't know. Maybe it would. I'm lacking in ideas. Cash should be optional as well, by the way, because I might not have wanted to catch that. Which I didn't really want to. But, um... 
Yeah, that's true, Hippie. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh, well. Silly me thinking he might not power. Oh, and he could just hit from the other direction as well. Oh, well. But he's next to the tree at least. There you go. That's good, isn't it? Might get a draw out of this game, despite everything. <laughs> it's a league. There's there's four divisions of thirteen of fourteen teams, um, and the top four of each division go to the playoffs, and then win. So it's like it's a is viewers league, community league. Uh, it is optional, um, Adon, as long as you put it on optional, isn't it? You can you can put it on optional, I think, so that you can do that. Yeah, aren't I? Still haven't got a re-roll. Only got 20k. I rolled a double one for the first game winnings. Glorious. I bought a box set of a TV show ages ago. I've never watched it. All oh, oh man, it's a fucking brilliant show. It's an optional, but only as you're inaccurate. Really? Yeah, you might want to keep the fumble. Oh, that's terrible, isn't it? Wow, so they can't do anything right, can they? <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, Sons of Anarchy. I've heard I've heard people mention it. Oh, Andre BV, thanks for the host. Is he going for the good old chain here? He might get it to be fair. Oh no, he just gets the knockdown. No chain for Jim. Right, what do I do here? Do I scatter it? That's a one, isn't it? If I stand him up, it's a two. -er. Oh, I can't scatter unless I fill in that square. And then I've got no recovery. Oh, I can just do it this way then. This is looking unlikely, to say the least. Go on, I might as well. Um, that's what I mean, he was, he was misplay, mis, misplayed dash, that's what I was subtly hinting at a misplay there I was. <laughs> oh, thanks Tony, that's made my day, I got all sex robots. I don't think a sex robot would make me happy to be honest. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't give a shit though, I just stacked it. <laughs> I'm stupid and I don't care, oh yeah. <laughs> I'm not at the I'm not in top form am I? Let's be honest. I'm just I'm just clicking, waiting for the game to end. 
basically. But yeah, I guess I should have uh, should have just got him into a into a uh, thing. I'm not happy at all. No hippie. <laughs> no. I am the least least happy person on planet Earth right now. Maybe, maybe not them. Maybe there's somebody more unhappy, but I'm pretty pretty high on the list of unhappy people. Wasn't surprised, crazy list. I didn't watch it. I didn't watch it, but um, but I'm not surprised that Elliot won. I think he's I think he's a better player, and uh, and Davos team wasn't very good, so not very surprising. No, I don't know what that is. Real faker. Yeah, people tell me that, but then some people said that it wasn't, but you know, I guess it's perspective, isn't it? Some people some people believe the bullshit when people complain about what the bad dice they're getting. So, um so that's the funny thing, isn't it? That's that's what I think's funny, that some people will stream and say, Oh, I can't believe it. I'm so unlucky, I'm I'm out bashing I'm out bashing orcs with uh with dark elves. I just need a red cross. And some people buy that lap that bullshit up and believe it, don't they? So it depends, and then other people are biased and think, oh, wow, Elliot's getting diced, even though he wasn't, so it's hard to say, isn't it, without seeing it myself. How oh, incredible, that must have been the first time in his life, Lil Baz, <laughs> that must have been literally the first game in his entire life that he didn't. <laughs> In the first half, though, it doesn't matter, does it? Because you expect to concede on defense. Right. So there's just one scoring threat, isn't there? And I don't have my re-rolls, so this is fun. And I should have had my scoring threat. I don't think I could have scored, though, even if I'd had it. So, well, I guess I wouldn't have conceded to this fucking skeleton. Oh, he's not in range! He's not even in range! <laughs> The skeleton isn't even in range, so what would I do if I had a if I had a mythic scoring threat? If the catcher was up here, I guess I would. I'd one dice him, and then go for a pickup with him or something. I don't know. I'll blitz this guy anyway, seeing as things I might as well. And of course it's my player. Okay, he doesn't die, thank God. Oh, God. <laughs> Skelly. I just can't believe he wasn't in range. Oh, I probably shouldn't have set up the tree, should I? Well, he would have just fouled him with Dirty Player anyway. I guess now he's going to foul the catcher with Dirty Player. Well, I'm glad I made the fucking one-turner at least, but I should have not played the second half shit. Because I started off trying to play it like how I wanted to play, which was an eight-turn stall. And then, like, three turns in, I thought, oh, I'll score on turn five, which wasn't the cleverest play, was it? I should have just carried on stalling it out. Never mind. I only paid for it with a dead dancer. <laughs> only paid the ultimate price for it. And a draw. Yeah. Oh, wow, good winnings. That's good. And an MVP on a, on a Lino that isn't dead. That's brilliant. I got I got I got some good luck in that match as well, didn't I? Like the one turn and the block dice I think were generally good for me. They felt good. Twenty, thirty, twenty-two. Not not too many both downs. Dodgers were good. 
It's just not forced forced for the uh, GFIs with the usual shit standard. But again, it's not that crazy, is it? Because nine three would be almost normal. <laughs> like ten two is normal, isn't it? So eight four isn't isn't that far away. The take routes were actually decent for once. So yeah, the problem is I was caught between the two the two strategies, wasn't I? In the second half, that was the killer. Really, I should have just stuck to my guns and stalled out the half. And then my dancer wouldn't have died. But I run him out like an idiot and he died. So can't really complain. Let me get block on this guy. And uh Well normally I'd get a reroll, but now I kinda want the second dancer. Ah, oh, I don't know what to do. I guess I've gotta get the dancer. I can't have an armor six dancer. Armor seven's bad enough. I want to feel your VIP ness all through the day and all of the night. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Hellboy. <laughs> well, there you go. That was uh, I, I should have won that. I should have played better second half. And that, that was it. I didn't play well enough. I did this weird thing. On a whim, decided to try and break through and score, and I just shouldn't have. I should have stalled it out in 1 2 1. And in the end, it cost me the win, cost me the war dancer. So, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.